and today we're working our legs and shoulders. The format will be a timed format. We'll do the leg exercises for 60 seconds, then we'll do it for 50, 40, and 30 seconds. Once we're finished with the leg section of the workout, we'll move on to the shoulders and we'll do the same thing. We'll work 60 seconds, then 50, 40, and 30. What you will need today is a mat, a ball, some weights, and, and an exercise band. If you don't have an exercise band, it's fine. You don't have to have it. And if you don't have weights, you can do this just with your body weight. Make sure that you warm up before you get started and make sure that you have some water. First exercise is going to be a low squat. So you will have your feet shoulder width apart and you will go as low as you can. Okay, you will hold, if you have a weight, you will hold your weight in a goblet style. Okay. <clears throat> and, and we'll do for uh, 60 seconds, then we'll move on to the set, next exercise and so on, and then we'll go back to this first exercise for the 50 seconds. <clears throat> Twenty seconds. Five. And time. <clears throat> Next exercise. We're going to be on the ground <clears throat> and we'll have our feet on the ball, hands to the side and you will go up and down with your pelvis. If you don't have a ball, just set your feet on the ground. time. <clears throat> Next exercise is going to be a sumo squat pause. Same thing, you can use a weight but you don't have to. Oops, let me show you first. Okay, for the sumo squat you're going to be wide legs, you're holding the weight, and we're just going to be pulsing. So you don't come all the way up. You just pulse. Make sure that your knees are pointing outwards and your toes and knees are aligned when you go, go down. Okay? So 
the pulse in here. We don't go all the way up. It's a long one minute. Halfway there. I can really feel this. Eight seconds. Oh. And one. Wow. Yes. go to the other side okay so you can count uh, to 30 and then switch okay but if you have a band you will place it just uh, right above your knees your feet are going to be on the ground and you can have your feet on the ball if you want to and what you do you'll be up keep this Bridge position the entire time, and you just open and close your legs, okay, for the entire minute. Try to keep the pelvis as high as you can, and squeeze your glutes. This also works your core. Keeping this position is engaging your abs and lower back muscles. Three seconds and time. Very good. And now we'll repeat the entire thing, but this time is going to be for 50 seconds each exercise. If you need to get some water or stretch, go for it. <clears throat> Okay, we start with the low squat, so it's going to get easier as we go down to 30 seconds, but your muscles are going to be tired, so You might need to move a little bit slower maybe. Don't go as low. Down on the floor, 
Miss the ball if you have it. Oops. One second and time. Okay, now the box. So the 50 second is faster. It doesn't feel like you're doing exercises long. The 10 seconds difference, you can really feel it. Twenty seconds. Woo -hoo! Oh. Ten. Five. And time. This one is a killer. Wow. Okay. And I'm gonna go back to the bend. I'm gonna feel this one tomorrow. Uh, After this, we have, we go back to the top for 40 seconds. Five seconds left. And time. Very good. Okay, I just stretch my quads a little. Okay, very good. Grab some water. And now we're going to go down to 40 seconds. So the exercise is getting shorter. The length of the exercise is getting shorter. But your muscles are tired. So you might need to change a little bit. Uh, if you need to drop the weight or reduce the weight or not go as slow so that you can go through the entire 40 seconds and here we go first exercise
See, I'm not going as fast, really working on my, keeping my form. And last one. Very good. Ooh, my legs are shaking. Okay. The glute bridge with the ball. And time. <clears throat> Two more squat pops. That's the killer for me. Halfway there. Ten seconds. Five. Ah. And last one. Wow. This one, I feel it everywhere in my legs and glute. Oh wow. Okay, I'm going to stretch out a second before I start the next exercise. My legs are shaking. Okay. your band above your knees. Keep your thumbs up. It's easy to sink. So really focus on Thinking about keeping the pelvis up. Five seconds. Two and one. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna get some water. And then we have last round for 30 seconds and then we'll move on to shoulders. Um, if the weight, if you're using weights, the weight is getting too heavy, you can either reduce them, the weight or drop it. Drop the weight and use it. Okay, last one. 30 seconds.
time. Okay. Okay, good bridge. seconds and time very good now the sumo pulse my favorite okay 30 seconds should go fast enough right going up and down. Sorry, pulsing. <laughs> See? The, um, I don't like this so much that I changed it. <laughs> That's why I was like, wow, that doesn't feel as hard. Sorry, guys. <laughs> That's why I didn't feel as hard. Sorry. You still got a, um, a leg workout, even if you did it, uh, just a regular a uh, sumo squat. <laughs> I was like, wow, that doesn't feel as hard. How come? And then I realized I was not pulsing. <laughs> okay, last one of the legs, and then we move on to shoulders. And here we go. Very good. Okay. If you need to stretch, uh, you can go ahead and do that. Get some water. And now we move on to uh, shoulders. Same format. So make sure that you use lighter weights for your shoulders. And if you're not using, if you're not weights, you're gonna, you always use uh, a water bottle, water bottles, or canned food for your weights, or just for the movement. You still feel uh, the muscle working. Okay. So first exercise is going to be a lateral raise with twist, and I will use lighter weights because uh, it's gonna be sixty seconds. Okay, so for this one, what you'll do, you come up, then you twist, okay, your hand, and then you go back down, okay? If it gets too hard, you can always alternate, okay? Halfway there. Fifteen 
seconds. Five. And time. Very good. For next set, you gotta do two exercises for the shoulders. Okay? Um, for the next one, we'll do the same thing. We, uh, and we will do the front raise, and then you do the same thing about twisting. And then coming back down. Again, if it gets too hard, you can alternate. Okay. Front raise with a twist and back down. Fifteen seconds. Five seconds. And this is the last one. Very good. Now we'll go back to the top and you're gonna go to fifty seconds of work. Lateral raise with a twist. Again, if the weights are used, you are using get heavy, you can either alternate or you can change weights or you can even drop the weights. Just make sure that you go slow with the movement. Keep a little bend in your elbow and in your knees. Ten seconds. You can always pause and stretch or take a break if you need to. And time. Okay, if it gets too much that uh, your neck start getting tired then you can always take a break. Okay, front raise with a twist. Changing timer to 30 seconds, sorry, 40 seconds, not 30, 40 seconds, and we go back to the larger uh, race with the twist. seconds and last one now we go to the front raise with a twist now one more round after this
last one. Very good. So now we go down to 30 seconds. And it's last round. Lateral raise with a twist. Very good. Can I stretch the shoulders a little bit? So that was, uh, that was pretty, it was a pretty fast workout that really uh, worked the, the leg and shoulder muscles pretty hard. Of course, if you want to make it harder, you can always increase the weight. Um, that was, that was the way that I used today was perfect. Um, okay. It feels good. Okay. So, uh, make sure that you stretch a little longer, drink plenty of water, have some protein and carbs after the workout to help, uh, recover. And, uh, uh if you guys are interested in doing, um, zoom, uh, one-on-one um, -on -one training uh, that's a service that I started um, a few weeks ago some of my clients asked if I could do that so I started to do that with them and it's working out pretty well so it's something that you guys are interested in interested you can leave a message you can go on my Facebook page and send me a message um, if you like the video like it leave a comment don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you next time. Have a wonderful day.